we talked before about the, the team of 2004-05, the, the first Chelsea title winning season for, for such a long time, inspired by some fabulous players like yourself, a good young team, but also this young brash manager that arrived in the Premier League for the first time. A special one, he said, and he certainly turned out to be that. Was he unlike anyone that you had worked with or since in football? You know, like people have this perception of, of Jose, obviously from the TV, you know, because he goes to press conference, he does a lot of things. But uh, I, I hope he doesn't mind me saying, but he sometimes came to our meeting and he said, guys, this is what I want. This is what I really think. This is what we do. But I'm going to go to the press conference and I will say this and I will say that. So don't be surprised. It's just the thing I want them to hear that. I want them to have that kind of feeling in our mind because I want them to do this. So sometimes it was really planned what he did and to take pressure of the team, to, to sort of play mind games with the opponent. He, he was he was like always ahead with this. Yeah? And, and and at the beginning as well, you know, he would, you could only have 16 players for the game. You know, people don't realize that until I think 2006, seven season, you could only have 16 players uh, coming to uh, to the game on the on the team sheet. So there was a huge competition. But he would be he would be always a step ahead, and he would say, "Okay, you're not playing because we play at home. We play a team who will sit bit that back, and I don't need." You, for example, to Makelela, he said, well, you don't need to play. I don't need a holding midfielder who is brilliant defensively when we're going to have 90% of the time ball on our feet. And so I don't need you. You have a time off and I take this player, extra striker. But then he would say to players, you're not dressing up because you didn't deserve. Like you didn't train well and then you didn't play well last time. So I give a chance to somebody else. So you knew exactly where you were and you needed to, he said that standard, that you never wanted to go uh, below and and the players really bought into it and as i said the preseason we started like that the hunt the standard started coming really high and we never dropped it and that was the that was the key that we really make sure that nobody dropped it how did he give you as the goalkeeper confidence to perform the way just he put me in that's all i needed from him <laughs> you know i have to say i came and I knew I will have a difficult uh, competition with Carlo Cudicini. And when I signed Claudio Ranieri, he was, uh, was the coach. So I was thinking, Phew, Carlo have a head start because he had been there and obviously everybody knew how great he was. So when we changed the manager, I was thinking, OK, in a way, it's, it's my advantage because now we come to the club where everybody starts in the same line. And I remember we were like the second week of the preseason in, in, um, in the US. And, and then Steve Clark came to speak to me and he said, well, just want to give you a heads up. You, you're going to play the first game. So, you know, you have a week, a little bit to prepare, get, you know, get your head around it. And then, you know, that was the, what I felt that the happiest in, in the world, because I was like, I want that. I just, the only Ranieri. thing I need <laughs> is to get the... Is that you? <laughs> He's a baby there with Kesman and Robin. Yeah. Do you think with Jose Mourinho, the, the story is over? For him in Chelsea there's been two chapters might there be a third you never know of course I cannot say I cannot say I'm not uh, you know I, I don't know how uh, the club or different clubs w was, was and... it talked about at all when you were there in in that in that uh, more board no we had uh, no we had coaches uh, we had you know we had coaches uh, which that we hoped we we will have for a long time and, uh, and obviously, when when Frank came back to the club, we hoped that that was the, you know, that, that was the moment where we will have the manager for a long time, the the Chelsea legend and the player who knows the the I'm club.